seeing out there today? Where do you feel like you did well? Where do you feel like you struggled? Yeah, I mean, you know, no matter what happened, you know, three turnovers isn't acceptable. Um, that's going to lose us games, and it did today. Um, you know, that's you know, we're going to shoulder that. I mean, we keep talking about it. We get we got to fix it. You know, that's the biggest thing is, you know, especially in this conference, you can't do that. So we're going to continue to work on that. Hendrick, uh, first four drives at halftime were all punts. What do you think is maybe off of the execution of those drives? Yeah, I mean, you know, they were they were giving us some good looks, uh, taking away some stuff that, you know, we hadn't planned for. Um, you know, eventually we started to find a rhythm, um, find some things that, you know, we're opening up for us. Um, Emmett, AG, you know, they're all running hard and, um, you know, just continuing to find a rhythm, you know, especially like you said, we couldn't really coming out. And, you know, I think as we continue to grow as an offense and some of these younger guys, you know, grow up, um, you know, myself included, um, we're going to be able to find that rhythm earlier. Is there a, a player too, especially that you'd like to have back? Yeah, of course. Um, you know, there's those two picks. Um, you know, there's you know the first one especially. You know, just got to throw that one. Got to see the safety and you know throw him more skinny. Um, but uh, you know, on the other side, that there's plays that you know happened that were great, and you know you, you never get a play back. So you know, just continue to live with it. Yeah, I would definitely say, you know, as an offense and just as a program, we have to go through these type of games to, you know, get to where we want to get to. So I know it's ugly and there's a lot of, you know, things we could have did better, turnovers and everything, but I definitely think we learn a lot from, you know, losing. You learn a lot of things in life from losing. And our team's been through so much adversity. Uh, we fought back at the end, you know, it didn't go as planned, but I definitely think we just got to learn from this and just keep moving like we've been doing all year. Yeah, I mean, we practice that a lot. And, you know, I think our operation went, went pretty smooth, um, you know, especially for, you know, like I said, I mean, we've got a lot of freshmen out there that don't have a lot of reps at that. And that just goes to show the effort, um, the work that we put in on the practice field in those situations. And, you know, like I said, as we continue to get better as an offense, you know, those things will start to click more. You know, it's just one little play, you know, one little thing at a time. Um, you know, eventually we're we're going to be deadly. On that on that second last play, did you feel your arm moving forward when when they hit it, or what, what was your perception of what happened there? Was it a fumble or anything like that? Um, you know, those are tough. You know, I'm I got my eyes down the field trying to make a play, and you know, in that moment, you know, you don't have time. You got to play it like it's a fumble because if you're just standing there looking at the ref, like it's an incomplete pass, like you're wasting you you waste four seconds. You know, that's the last thing that we can do. So, you know, we treated that you know, I, in my mind as soon as I as soon as I felt it come out of my hand, I immediately thought fumble, you know, just, just sprinting back there, trying to get on it. You know, we knew what the last play was gonna be. Um, so, you know, I, in situations like that, you know, they may have reviewed it and it may have been coming for it, I don't know. Um, but you know, treat it like a fumble and play it at, play it as it lies, I guess. Yeah, they, you know, they started to heat us up a little bit. Uh, you know, some interior stuff that, um, you know, I don't know if they had really shown before, but you know, the old line, the old line, um, you know, those guys. I, I trust those guys, and we're going to continue, you know, work on seeing those looks, you know, stuff that teams are going to game plan for us. You know, they're going to come up with new blitzes and. Um, trying to exploit our weaknesses and you know and part of that you know Emmett did a great job today you know picking up some of those and um, you know being a check down as well so how do you feel about Hunter talked about the offensive rhythm from your perspective how do you feel about that and just the way that works for you when there's three of you guys rotating running backs? Uh, yeah I definitely just say you know you always got to be ready uh, at the running back position you know AG fleeks those guys can make plays and everything and so uh, having all, all three of us out there we just got to all go out there and do our jobs. And even, you know, I know you guys give a lot of, you know, blame to H. You know, he's our quarterback. But, 
you know, I love him. Our O line loves him. We're going to do a better job protecting, giving him more time to throw the ball, things like that. But from the running back position, just going out there and just competing every every game and uh, trying to help put uh, the offense in a great position on second and third down, especially. Yeah, I mean, obviously, Emmett and the running backs did a phenomenal job. You know, no balls on the ground by them. Um, you know, that last fumble, um, I mean, I don't know if there's there's a whole lot. And even the second last fumble, um, you know, maybe just feeling that a little bit more. But, you know, I think, you know, this whole week we've been working on that. You know, two hands on the ball, um, just getting up in the pocket. Um, and so, I mean, besides, besides those... Um, you know, just those two weird, you know, in, in the in the pocket, you know, you can't always feel that stuff. Um, but I got to do a better job of that. And, um, you know, obviously, like I said, the picks, um, you know, just need to get more reps at that. Yeah, I definitely think, you know, you're going to get a team that's going to come back the next week and fight. You know, we've been through a lot of adversity. Like I said, uh, this team, we all love each other. We're all going to go out there and play hard for each other. And so uh, you're definitely going to see a team that, you know, doesn't quit and give up. We're never going to quit. We're just going to watch the film, learn from it, and get ready for Maryland. You know, that's another great team coming to our house. So we just got to prepare and just get ready for that.